Remember the time I told you I can't online shop? A few weeks ago, I wanted to order Christmas chickens, and I was amped about it. They're like these wicked cute chickens. They have a scarf. They're going to light up. I'm going to put them in the front of the house. I'll put a picture right here so you can see what they look like. They just got here. Let me just show you what I got. What the fuck am I going to do with this? I'm going to get Tina's reaction. Right, this is what I ordered. I'll take you guys. All right, close your eyes. I'm pissed off. <laughs> Let me see the picture again. Oh, you just get what you want. Let me see that. They are not no. Look, it's the spotlight shining on it. Are you shitting me? <laughs> Tina. <laughs> said it was two feet. You get my measured on the floor. <laughs> I thought it was 3D. No. You know what I mean? Tina thinks I got what I ordered because of this spotlight. But I think I got duped. They presented it deceivingly. Mom was gonna order these big ornaments. We were gonna have a whole display. We had it all planned out. Oh yeah. In the front of the house. Who I was gonna get icicle that? lights. I had a whole thing. I thought this was like a fucking thing. It's fucking broken. It's broken. No, that's just fake, isn't it? Fucking stupid is what it is. I can't wait to show her. The Christmas chickens. Oh yeah, the Christmas chickens. Yeah. Did they arrive? They're here. Okay. All right, close your eyes. I'm going to show you. I don't have to. What are they? Tiny? <laughs> they mini chickens? Are you shitting me? See? Oh, no. <laughs> Let me see it. Come on. It said it was two feet. I know. I told Tina that. You can't put this up. <laughs> <laughs> the freaking bush is bigger than the chicken. You won't even see it. That's awful. Heat it up. It's not even got, got lights, on lights on it. lights on it. Oh, this is a ripoff. This is, is what we sad. ordered. She no, said it isn't. She said it's a the spotlight shining on it. It looks big, then. It looks big. They angled it. That is false advertising. I'm pissed. I was expecting, like, you know, Winnie the Pooh? Me too. Like this yep. guy. Very sad. He didn't, What happened? He's broke. She dropped him. You know that thing you do? What I made, you know, what I thought I was ordering, and what arrived. Yep. We got taken. I was so excited for this. What Did we even Tina? order the inflatable balls? <laughs> now we have balls coming and no chickens. What are you talking about? We ordered food? these big mother effing balls. You're doing outside. The fucking electricity doesn't even work. It's okay, I know Are you, guys. you serious? I know a guy. I know a guy. <laughs> Are you a little sad though, Michelle? I am 900% sad. I can't believe this is what showed up. I'm shocked. What the fuck? The hell is that? That's someone's idea of a joke. She said it was two feet. A lie. <laughs> Such a lie. You think they were giggling when they mailed it? I don't know. Tina is reading the reviews for the chickens. These chickens are tiny and flat. What are you doing? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Nowhere in the description does it say that they are flat, both in dimension and in color. Just no. This product is a flat image on a piece of plastic. Do not buy. <gasps> oh, frag. <laughs> Fuck you and your chicken. Fraudsters. Dicks. Chicken dicks. Oh. Cocks. <laughs> <laughs> Balls are on the way! Oh my god. They're on the way and they got no friggin' friends. Lonely balls. Balls of no cock. <laughs> <laughs> Literally had one star. You're telling me that's a flat thing, Tina? Yes. That looks 3D to my eyeballs. But it's higher so it looks like he's standing. Hang on, do that again. It does look big. That's crazy. It's a scam. As if the Christmas chicken saga couldn't get any worse, now I have to go in person to my least favorite store to return them. 
That was the worst experience of my life. There's two girls working, and they're both helping someone. The lady on the right is being a wicked biatch. The person on the other side is helping this, like, guy. This guy does, like, a jump, spin, turn, and then stops and is staring at me. So I'm staring back at him like this. I make eye contact with the other cashier, and she looks at me like... So I do it back. I find out her name is Happy. She didn't seem too happy. Someone else came with cookies. Whoever came in with the cookies offered everyone a cookie. They didn't offer me a cookie. I would have loved a cookie. That really would have helped me through my Walmart experience. Back to the car. It's freezing, so I'm kind of walking faster than my normal pace. But I felt like I was running. These two guys are walking by me, and he's like, hey. And so I said, hi. And he goes, I love you. I don't love you back. This is just what happens at Walmart. The more I think about it, the more I feel like the world is punishing me for trying to celebrate Christmas before Thanksgiving. I go to Stop and Shop because Dad Dukes needs some food for lunch tomorrow. And Mom Dukes is up at Auntie Janet's because they're making Thanksgiving food. Because we got no stove. But that's a story for another time. Right now, I just, I gotta go. I gotta go find some peace because it is not at Walmart. Boom, baby.